It's impossible. Why would my master assign me a trial that can't be done? Quiet, idiot. Every beast in the ruins will converge on you. Oh, you startled me. I didn't see you approach. My master says there are valuable materials behind that boulder over there. But get this, the blasted thing can't be moved. My instructions were to go to a platform in the ruins. Meditate and let the force empower me. But I've meditated till I can't see straight and nothing. That's rather pathetic for a Padawan, isn't it? I did everything I could. So I'm gonna get drummed out of the order because I can't move a rock that can't be moved. It's absurd. Hey. What if, maybe you could help me? Are you good at this meditation thing? There's no doubt about it. Oh, thank you. You're a lifesaver. So, just kneel at the altar nearby. Supposedly, if you find deep inner peace, you'll be able to move the boulder. If you fail, I can tell my master it wasn't just me who couldn't move it. can't decide if I'm ashamed that I couldn't do it or happy that my mission is complete. There was supposed to be something important behind the boulder. You did it! I can't decide if I'm ashamed that I couldn't do it or happy that my mission is complete. There was supposed to be something important behind the boulder. That was a complete and total waste of my abilities. But... Iniki... Master Quiljake, why are you here? Uwana wada blota wijawa. O wama wanka matuske. Manchi doti puna puna. Kabuk nuni snemo. Kunta chuta. Kasu ya likulira. Tanki kum. But, Master, it's not my fault. I didn't ask for help. I, I tried to decline. That's right, Master. I imposed myself on Flingeld's mission. Oh, Kakiza Spida Perupa. Gadwa Shiniko Higa Danulia. Atungi Ma Chechu. I Kutsi Nankihe. Thank you, Master. Your patience and faith in me are a compliment. Imache. Churon chika jiliska chanana. Liska taka ya yoska ukle yuga chesko pukuta. I had the clarity to commune with the force. What do you think of that? Ki patu patu. Manji doti puna puna. Kabuk nuni snemo. Wana wada blota wijawa. O wama wanka matuske. Maybe next time his trials should make sense. Liska taka, ya yoska ukle yuga chesko pukuta. Ketusta barawanga, ni subul kobo pomo? Yes, yes, master. Wana wada blota wijawa, o wama wanga matuske. Rotten procreating beasts. Padawans will start dying if this keeps up. Oh, Padawan. At least you made it through. The Horants are everywhere lately. Hulking, razor-mawed monsters with nasty dispositions. They're multiplying fast and growing bolder. There's some in the water since the Flesh Raiders came. I could use help getting things under control. What would be involved? Eliminating a Horanth matriarch and patriarch will slow the beast's population explosion. But they're tough to find and even tougher to kill. The matriarchs and patriarchs tend to gravitate in different clearings. You'll have to hunt them down separately, if you're willing to help. Of 
course I'll do it. Relieved to hear it. While you're out there, removing any of the beast's eggs you spot would help too. It's up to you. Hope you fare well. I'll be here holding down the camp. The Horned Matriarchs and Patriarchs make a distinctive howl when they mate, and when they die. Heard it echoing throughout the ruins. I've marked fewer of the beasts bounding through the area already. You have my gratitude. Their nests were everywhere. Were being the operative word. It's prospects like you that make me so proud to serve. Be well. Indulge your religious angst later, we have bigger problems. Kaizen, Master Yuan has been at the Jedi Temple for hours. Nalan must have used some force trick to make you think he was Yuan. Nalan will need more than the Fount of Rajavari when I catch up with him.
No further, Seeker. You come here unpurified. It is an insult to Rajivari's memory. Rajivari's apprentices were flawed, but they walked the fire and were reborn. Only a personal sacrifice will show your strength and resolve, Seeker. Will you be purified by flame? I will stand in the fire and show you my strength. Powerful words, but self-sacrifice is the path of a fool. <gasps> the Fount of Rajivari is not kind to intruders. Flee or suffer. Your head would be Nayland's trophy by now. I came here to prove myself to Nayland, but the traps. It doesn't matter. You're the enemy. If I can still hold a blade, I can stick you in the heart. That makes you my enemy. Sparing you will only lead to greater destruction. Ah, a disciple of Rajavari after all. Go now. You've earned the right. Of course, here is the other. Seekers of forbidden knowledge always have their pursuers. If you came for Nalan Relic, he has been and gone. So much is fleeting. But I remain, and I remain the man I was. Rajavari. What precisely are you? Your pet is brighter than he looks. When my body failed me, I refused to become one with the Force. How could I? The Jedi were still imperfect. Here, in my laboratory, I had refined certain devices. I could give one chosen apprentice decades of experience in a day. An apprentice to become worthy to carry my vision. Your students trusted you, and you used them. They deserved better. Those apprentices were like my own children, gifted, loyal. I hope this Nalan Ralak might succeed them. A disappointment. Nalan walked through the traps instead of solving them. He suffered greatly. You at least survived with your mind intact. Nalan, alas, did not. 
Nayland's condition makes no difference. I just need to find him. I miscalculated. Nayland's mind wasn't equal to the wisdom he demanded. I have made not a successor, but a monster. Nayland will not remake the Jedi. He wishes to destroy them and everything else on this world, beginning with the Great Forge, where lightsabers are made. Without the Forge, the Jedi lose their martial power. You must stop Nayland before he destroys it. Perhaps I can correct your mistake. That weapon won't suffice against Nayland, but you carry the hilt of the First Blade, an old friend. A simple procedure would convert it to a working lightsaber hilt, and perhaps a crystal from the Forge Caves to power it, given its age. Finally, I will carry the weapon of a Jedi. Pass through the caves and seek the forge at the mountain summit. Stop Nayland, this abomination my knowledge has created. My mind is stronger than Nayland's. I could be the acolyte you wanted. Use your device on me. I cannot. The devices were spent during Nayland's procedure. Stop Nayland before he destroys the Jedi Order. Someday, I will see it saved. Javari seemed confident, but this hilt is thousands of years old. It may not survive the process.
fitting that it's you, armed with the last lightsaber this forge will ever make. Look at her. Another Jedi to nod and preach and do nothing while the Flesh Raiders ravage our home. I know Rajivari's secrets. Horrors that the Jedi, this Jedi, have been chasing, and only I can protect us, our families, and our future. Whatever future you'd create for Kalakori Village would be tainted by what you've become. Shut up! You attacked our friends, our brothers, in cold blood! But maybe we don't have all the facts. What nalan has been saying, something's not right. Watch then. Justice needs witnesses. The time for discourse is over. Scotcharak mask was loud. Spittle the tannis. Unta kulua. Your scow open. Let's have this done. I'd forgotten the smell of my own blood. I, I yield. But uh, Nalan, he, he he's never been beaten. What are you going to do with him? There's only one way this can end. No, you can't do this. He defended our entire village. He's a hero. He committed atrocities, risked people's lives. It ends now. Just do it right. We should take him home. The others will want to say goodbye. I suppose one can't be right all the time. I don't believe in this scorekeeper. How can I be her herald? Zantalis, Mortavrapsak, Bajulambasarsk, Parskupotrak, Mozorksk, Kundapolua. Being the herald of the scorekeeper, having a powerful Trandoshan ally? Who would argue? Ragosk Prakshais, Fetoskus Sarsk, Parskupotrak, Vorkantisk, Ramoras Dajava, Kurkuska. I seem to be cursed. Why do I always get the pupils who think they're the exceptions to the rule? Master Silvarte, it's true that our Padawans are acting a bit strangely, but I don't think there's cause for concern. Wait, I have an idea. You, Padawan, I know you. I'm sorry, Master, are you talking to me? Yes. It's what I usually do when I wish an audience with someone. Master Silvarte is concerned about a couple of our Padawans. He suspects that they are, well... If I'm correct, they are following their passions down a dark path. Am I to understand that love leads to the dark side? Emotions disrupt balance. When you hold one person in higher regard than others, it clouds clarity and twists reason. We mustn't stand by. In all other aspects, these two are model pupils, but I agree we would be remiss if we didn't do what we can to settle the issue. They may be more open and revealing with a student like you. We need you to confront them and discover if they are indeed cultivating a romance. 
I'm basically to become a glorified snoop, then? You're helping the Order root out the seeds of darkness. There's no task more important. Their names are Morrison and Spanios. As we speak, they are in the ruins of Lower Caleth. So go, talk with them, and report back what you discover about the relationship. Try not to alert or alarm them. If they are in love, they are sure to be volatile. Paduan, I heard you begun your trials. Master Yuan says you show great promise. No doubt you are pleased to have come this far. But some Jedi have the ability to do more, help more people. Interested? Always looking for a way to help. A war is brewing in the greater galaxy. The Sith Empire plots against the Republic and the Republic looks to the Jedi for aid. But not all who train to become Jedi are skilled combatants and leaders. Many are scholars, diplomats, strategists, and scientists. Which is why we've created a simulation to test Jedi and Padawans and certify them to lead Republic troops. If you're looking for a leader, you've come to the right person. Where do I start? Confidence is good. A leader must have confidence in herself and others. Just don't get arrogant. The droids here in the yard have been programmed to act according to Imperial military protocols and battlefield tactics. Demonstrate your proficiency at defeating these droids, and you will be on your way to qualifying to lead Republic troops into battle. Can you do it? Whatever you say. Excellent. The first set of training droids are ready for you. Get to it. I'm impressed. Hopefully we'll have something more challenging for you soon. That was an impressive go earlier, but we've upped the programming on these droids. Care to give it another shot? Get out there and show them what you're made of. Good work out there. We're going to have to get you a real challenge next time. You made it look easy last time, but we've thrown some surprises in there for you this time. Get out there and show them what you're made of. Another impressive round. Looks like we'll have to make things tougher next time. Your last round with the droids was impressive, but we've made modifications to their behavior that should make for a real challenge. Get out there and show them what you're made of. This is it. You've been tearing through these droids about as fast as I can repair them. But we just received the latest combat simulation data from the Republic and combined it with the data we've collected from your earlier fights. It'll be tough, but if you can do this, there'll be nothing more we can throw at you. You'll be fully qualified to lead Republic troops in battle.
Unbelievable. To tell the truth, I didn't think it was possible. I think you've more than qualified for the job of leading Republic soldiers in battle. Here's your certification. Congratulations. Amazing. You found it! Well done, Morrison. Oh, Spanios. I couldn't have done it without you. You're amazing. I don't care what the Masters say, we're proving everyone wrong. Come here and give me a kiss. Go ahead. Plant one on him. I would. He's cute. Who are you? This isn't what you think it is. You have nothing to worry about. I'm a friend. Oh, really? You say you're a friend. Does that mean you're not here to blow the whistle on our romance? Spanios, you just confirmed the truth to this person. I'm sorry, my love, but I'm sick of hiding. The Order is wrong. Fear, not emotion, is the adversary of the Jedi way. Ironically, the Masters fear emotion, and therefore, they deny us its bounty. The power of our love is why we work so well together. Our teamwork allowed us to find this rare lightsaber crystal. So our passion actually strengthens the Order. Maybe you're right, but it's not for me to decide. Spanius, please help me convince this upstart not to expose us! I love you, Morrison. And so if you believe we must remain hidden, I honor that. But it may take a sacrifice. You mean the crystal? I agree, my love. Friend, if you tell the Masters we're not romantically involved, we'll give you this powerful crystal for your future lightsaber. Would that buy your silence? That sounds pretty good to me, but I'm not sure I can trust you. Don't fear. I will keep my word. If you tell the Masters you found nothing suspicious here, come back to us, and we'll give you the crystal. Don't you dare try to fool us. We will know if you do. Were you successful, Padawan? Did you find our pupils in the ruins? Tell us, what did you uncover about the nature of Spanius and Morrison's relationship? Are they romantically involved? I discovered that there is no romance between them, Masters. You see, Master Silvarte, your concerns were for naught. I'm relieved to hear this. Surprise, but most relieved. You've handled this matter with great character. The Order is fortunate to have you in the fold. That's all well and good, but am I excused? I'm sorry if you feel put upon, youngster. Now that you've befriended them, you might check in on our students. Otherwise, good luck with the rest of your training. Well, our blackmailer returns. Back for the crystal, no doubt. Thank you for keeping our secret. Just hand it over, and we can be done with this. Blood sucker. You got what you wanted, my sweet. It's a small price to pay. Don't mind her. Good luck to you.
Hold on to that lady, Spanos. She's a keeper. I sure think so. Here's the crystal. Goodbye, friend. A flesh raider, baby. See how the Force tests my dedication to assisting the helpless of this world. You did the right thing. Leave him with me. I'll convene the Council to decide how to handle this.